Hello everyone, it's Grandma Jackie and I'm back with another video. Um, this is still um, things that I found while we was on vacation. Um, Lila just left for the day to go with her daddy for tonight and so I'll get her back again tomorrow. But So I'm still drinking my coffee. So if you guys need a drink, this might be a long haul. So get yourself a drink. Um, some of the stores that I have for you, hopefully I get through them all, is Marshalls, Ross, TJ Maxx, Home Goods, Tuesday Morning, and one thing from Joann's. The rest of the things from Joann's and stuff I put out in the shed for a shed haul. So, um, I don't even know where to start. I think I'm going to go ahead and do Ross first since we really didn't get a whole lot there. Um, it's still in bags, so forgive my crinkling and leaning and everything. Again, real life. Um, I got this Method All Purpose um, Cleaner and it is Ginger Yuzu. I don't know. But this is from Ross, it's $2.99. It says it cuts grease and grime. I gave it a smell and it smelled pretty good so I mean I don't remember what it smells like now but I know I wouldn't have picked it up if it didn't smell good. It smells clean and refreshing and almost got a grapefruit smell to it believe it or not but it says ginger something. So anyways yeah I just wanted to try the Method brand. It's $2.99, so give it a try. They have kind of like dupes from um, the Dollar Tree, like the daily shower cleanser and stuff like that, which I just used last night. Um, my husband got this. It is $4.99. He was going to get it at one other time and then changed his mind, and then we went to Ulta, and he looked at it at Ulta, the price there, and he was like, next time we go to Ross, I'm picking it up if they still have it. And it is the Murray's Bileys <laughs> Beard Balm. I don't know. Because he does have a beard. He's pretty wooly right now. But I can't talk him into getting a haircut. But yeah, it was $4.99. I have no idea what this does. He's got some beard stuff from the Dollar Tree that he likes too. Ew, this looks like wax. Ugh. Anyways, yeah, he got this, and he really wanted it for some reason, so hey, hey, we got lots of candles. My husband got, really got into smelling the candles with me, so we got a big candle haul. Um, this is White Pumpkin. It comes in a container like this and it was $7.99 and this actually smells really good it's got the three wick it smells so good it's kind of like a spice cinnamon something I wish it had all the scents in it it's with essential oils but it doesn't tell you you know like Bath and Body Works it tells you what's in it but yeah this smells really really good so, I was super excited about that. That was from Ross. Um, we just did a lot of shopping while we were down there because we had some really rainy days. And let me tell you what, the stores down there don't have near the stuff that they have up here. I was so excited. Like, I'm sure I squealed several times, you guys. This was... Move the thing. Eleven ninety nine, and it is a harvest garland. Is what they are calling it. But look at that. The gnomes. Try not to shine it bright. Super super cute. Fell in love with those babies. Even though my husband says I have enough fall stuff. He said the fall stuff has grown in the past two years. I didn't realize it until I got it all out. 
And then I'm doing pretty good on fall stuff. <laughs> you know, I have a bunch more in here. Um, the one thing that I did do is, like I said, whenever I pulled out all my seasonal stuff, I was going to go through stuff. So if I'm not going to use it this year, it's getting rid of. And I have boxes and boxes in there. I really need to get rid of them. I will eventually. Okay. I have this shirt. And it was $9.99. Got butterfly on the back. And the different, what do you call it? The different phases of the moon. There you go. And it says, become the change. I really liked it. Plus, it's one of them extra soft, soft ones. And it's also got a butterfly on the front. Yeah. Baggy, soft, really nice. Really nice. Okay. One more bag from Ross, and then I think that's it. From Ross. I also picked this up just to try, and it is the Pumpkin Spice Scones Premium Mix. Just add water, mix, and bake. It was $3.99. And it gives you pretty good instructions on the back. So I was like, I'm going to try it for $3.99. May as well. May as well. Then they had so many things for planners and planner people, which I am. Um, I actually, <laughs> I have one of my notebooks from the Dollar Tree sitting right here with a list of things to do and a list of things that I have crossed off. <laughs> it's this one. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm working on that list. But anyways... This was $2.99, and it's the little llama. It says, no problema. And it is just like a little, I don't know, a little notebook with lined, lined papers in there. Several pages worth. For $2.99, I thought that was a pretty good deal. I figure out where I set everything. Then, I, you know how I do the Traveler's Journal? I take it with me everywhere usually it's in my purse but this one says always on vacay my travels and it is just again another notebook and it is $3.99 or it was $3.99 I'm gonna open this because I literally want to see the inside of it there was not one that was open in the store And actually, we don't have a Ross near us. We have to travel if we want to go to a Ross. We do have a Marshalls. Oh, yes. Check this out. Oh, I'm checking it out. I'm <laughs> not even showing you. Bon voyage. And then it's got the different... Wait. Wait. There was something in here. Where did it go? Oh, here. Tickets to ride. The tickets you need for your travels makes great keepsakes. Um, was in your first train ride in the foreign country? Did anything funny or unusual happen? Um, did you get tickets to ride a Ferris wheel? Things like that. So it's just a place to put all your tickets, which is kind of cool because, you know, if you go see shows or whatever, this one says, use your senses. Take a moment to write down some of the little things you notice when you visit your destinations. What does it sound like? Y'all know I just talked to the ocean. Um, is there a favorite song playing in the distance or you hear street sounds? What do you smell? A pizza pie or the salty ocean air? So yeah, this was awesome. Awesome. Definitely going to use that. Um, another um, happy planner I found there for $3.49 and it is I believe just the notes 
Yes, just the little different dividers with just notes, but cute. Because you can also use it for a planner too. And for $3.49 for a happy planner notebook, that's pretty good. Then last, I think, from Ross, unless I find something else mixed in here, is a happy planner. It's from July 2021 through December 2022. And I know, I don't need another planner, but I got one. It says, Seek Beauty in All Things. And it's a bigger one. It has a bigger layout, which I like because I do a lot of writing. And see, we're in September now. Can't really open it because it's got the plastic thing on it. But see how big that is? You can write on the months. Now, the one I have now that I'm working with, I can't really write on the month. I have to turn the page and write on the weeks. But here is the one for, for the days and the weeks. So that's much bigger, too. So I think this will really come in handy. The one I'm working on now, I think, ends in December, too. So, yeah. Just jump right in here. And I'm just trying to see. At the back, at the back of all of the months, of course, you have the notes. So you can take notes down for each month. So how much was this? This was $12.99 for a big old happy planner. That is a good deal, especially if you are a planner. So, moving right along, I gotta get on it. Um, we went to Joanne, so always down there. Because my husband has the Joanne's app on his phone. Because at the time, I didn't, I didn't have my my phone on me when we went to Joanne's once, and we needed um, a discount or something. Oh, the price came off. Darn it. Um, but anyways, they had deals going on, and so they sent him, like, a little update on the app or whatever for the deals. And so we decided to go to the Joann's that was in Panama City. Um, we went down there, and I found several things that you'll see later on in a shed haul. But I also found this material that I just fell in love with. It is $2.99 a yard. It's usually... $7.99 a yard, so it was on sale for $2.99 a yard. I spent right around $30, I think. I don't remember. 20 something. Anyways, I got over eight yards. I took the whole thing. But look at that. And it's the so soft, cozy material that I make my quilts out of. So, yeah, guys, this is my next quilt. I know I said I need to make one for my son. But I couldn't resist this. This is going to be like a fall quilt. Hopefully I can get it done before falls over because I got a lot of other projects. But if I don't, I'm still going to make it. <laughs> yeah, I've, I fell in love with this. Um, I could not find... Usually I have two, two different um, designs for the front and one whole design for the back. And then I have the middle, which is a flannel. Um, I think I have a bunch of middle left, and I couldn't find any other design that I really like that went with this. So, I'm not sure if this will be the whole back, or this will be part of a design up front, and then I'll put it with another design. I haven't decided yet. But anyways, long story short, I fell in love with this material. So, let's see where I can put this at. Under here. As long as I don't knock anything over. Okay, um, next, that wasn't a very big haul, is going to be the Home Goods store. And I got one of their bags for 99 cents because I just fell in love with it. This is thankful. They are 99 cents. I got a few bags from Marshalls too, those super cute. But, um, my husband got these cookies, and they're called David's Cookies, and it's chocolate Florentine lace, and, oh, $2.99. So, you got those. 
Then you got these that are vanilla Florentine lace. Also $2.99. Then a candle. Sand and Fog Pumpkin Spice. And it was $7.99. There's that. And yeah um my husband and i are going to find a way to repurpose these things we are it's a two wick candle and it smells amazing and i love the way sand and fog burns absolutely love the way they burn so there's another candle here comes another one we had a good time we was trying to make light of things because like the, for the first several days there was a lot of rain and things which was left over from the hurricane so um, this one is a sand and fog candle and it says inspired on the California coast it doesn't really say oh Tahitian vanilla there you go it was $7.99 I hate it when they put the tags on the thing but that's okay we'll take it off and it's like a very light, woody vanilla. And it's got three wicks. So yeah, my husband was helping me pick these out. And he was like, they have entirely too many of these things to smell. And every story went in. So yeah, this, I love this bag. I love all the colors of this bag. This just screams fall okay so there's that one that was all for the at home store we didn't really buy a whole lot there so let's jump over here to tuesday morning um, my husband's seen this maple bacon coffee pods of course he's gonna get something bacon you guys this was nine dollars it was originally 14.99 and, and it was on clearance so yeah maple bacon coffee pods Of course. Of course. There's a few more things from Tuesday morning that would be out in the shed hole because it was for the shed. My husband's seen this box and he brought it to me and he's like, hey. So this is one of those hard cardboard wooden boxes. It was $7.99. I could not pass that up. Could not. I have another one somewhere. From Joann's. I might have taken it out to the shed hall. But anyway, some things that were in it are my husband found some of these um, vinyl things for the Cricut. Um, this one was $4.99 and it is the black and red buffalo check. So I got two of those. And then this one is kind of like a, I don't know, a teal sea foam color maybe. And it was $3.99. You got two of those. Ah. There. Then I got this little cupcake thing, and it's one of those surprise thing, like blind bag, th bag things, and it was three ninety nine for one of the girls for probably Christmas. Not sure what it is. Never even seen them before. And then, whenever I'm out and about in those kind of places, I check out all the spices because you never know what you're going to like. Um, I got Kickin' Chicken Finger Lickin' Spice Blend. <laughs> Sounds good to me. It was $3.99. So, I just recently redid all my spices. I posted that picture on Instagram. But I redid all my spices and got rid of a bunch of spices that were expired. Like, way, way expired. Because I know spices will go longer than they say, but... These are way, way expired. So, yeah. Kickin' Chicken Finger Lickin' from the Gourmet Collection. I had to try that. Had to. So, move this out of the way. Okay. Now, I think we're going to move on to TJ Maxx, because that's another one we didn't get very many on. I told you this was going to be a long video. We're at 20 minutes already. 
Okay, I might have to just you do my marshals in another haul. Um, I got this for Lila. It's a cute little fall outfit. $9.99. The camera is not going to do this justice. here no maybe over here that's more of the color but yeah it's an outfit comes with little leggings it's super super soft on both of them I got it in a 3t so she could wear it this fall so, there's that then I have this obsession with aprons in my kitchen and I even have some out in the shed, but I found this, fell in love with it. Of course, why wouldn't you? This was $7.99. This is also from TJ Maxx, $7.99. Check that out. It's got the big pocket up front, which I like because you can shove a bunch of stuff in there. So yeah, $7.99, I love it. This is definitely gonna go in my kitchen. Another thing from TJ Maxx, which I don't need any more of these, and I was just watching a video this morning on Cassie over Bargain Budgeters. I will link her her um, channel down below, but she was hauling stuff too. And we're in the same boat. Our husbands say uh, that we have enough pretty much, <laughs> but it's, it's never enough. It's never enough. Um, this was $3.99. I fell in love with this. On the inside it says, boo. And it's on both sides. It's a really heavy mug too and it's by global design so yeah <laughs> I got another mug I am putting up all my mugs with my seasonal so whenever I'm boxing up my seasonal stuff I'm boxing up my mugs as well and I'm getting them out with every season so at first I was trying to store them all like yeah that didn't work not working, uh-uh. <laughs> so I thought I'd just box them up for the season and pull them out for the season. Okay. Sorry. This one's kind of heavy. Yeah, I think what I will have to save Marshalls because it's it's a fairly decent size haul. This one, $12.99, TJ Maxx. When night comes, witches fly. Oh my goodness huge $12.99 of course it's got the wooden top but it is what kind it doesn't say the scent I can't tell you what the scent is because I don't find it anywhere but it's amazing oh my gosh that's probably my favorite one so far. It's a three wick candle, it's huge. I hope it burns good, but oh my lord. I can't even describe what scent it is. Kind of like fall with some apple mixed in it. And not not like cinnamony apple, but it's good, it's good. $12.99, guys. And I'm telling you, my husband had a good time smelling all these things. Sand and fog. Another sand and fog. It's in a black jar. <laughs> this one is called Fright Night. Oh my goodness. It smells very similar to that other one I just showed you. But this one has a little more cinnamony smell to it but it smells like fall, apple, and cinnamon. If that even explains it good. I don't know. Then I seen these dresses 
and I really liked it and I didn't think they had one my size. My husband actually found one for me. It was $16.99, so it was a little pricey, but I really liked how soft and flowy it was. So it kind of has like the old school pillow material, the old um, feather pillows, kind of like that. And it's really long. It kind of crosses over in the front. I'm not going to be able to do it justice. I would say I'd do a try on, but <laughs> like that in the front. Okay. Next, I think this is the last thing. It is. I got a blanket. Oh my gosh. This was also $16.99, so it was a little pricey too, but I fell in love with the color. Like, there is the true color. But it's one of those really soft ones. And it is a throw. It's called luxury throw, whatever that means. And it is a 50 by 70 inches. So yes. Oh, this is going to go on my bed because I already have my one from last year. <laughs> a little soft pumpkin one. So this one will probably go on my bed. But yes, that, that's going to be it for this haul. And I'm just going to have to just keep going and do a Marshalls in another video because this one's already at 26 minutes. I'll have problems uploading. You guys know how that goes. Um, I hope you guys are having an amazing day. If you would, please give this video a thumbs up. It really helps out my channel. Thank you so much for watching. And um, please be safe. Take care of yourself. And I will catch you later.